Hey guys, welcome back to this video. In this video, we will be talking about what is the biggest difference between Dynatrace and Splunk. The two things are entirely different. Splunk is primarily a law collection analysis and visualization solution. It can collect metrics now as well. It purposes after the fact forensics as a part of a problem resolution process. That problem can span the entire game out from security to infrastructure operations to application operations. The primary competitors to Splunk are Elastic and Sumologic. Dynatrace is an application performance management solution designed to automatically measure the performance of an application, discover the topology and dependencies that our application relies upon and determine. If a problem is in the code or in the software and hardware infrastructure that supports the applications, the key to Dynatrace's ability to do that is real-time topology and dependencies mapping engine called SmartScape. There is no similar capability in Splunk. The principal competitors to Dantrace are App Dynamics, New Relic, and Instant. Rather than viewing these things as competitors, many companies use them together. In fact, Dynatrace has integration with Splunk and Splunk has an Splunk app for Dynatrace up in Splunk base. The most common use for using them together is that Dynatrace finds the problem, determines if it is in the code or not, if not determines whether the software and hardware infrastructure the problem resides, Splunk is then used to drill down into the part of the identified infrastructure to determine the exact number of the problem, for example security breach. So that's all from this video and always see you in the next video. Thank you guys.